Moments after the British High Commissioner, James Quinn, handed over kitchen items to help and shelter, he told the press how things are coming along with the need assessment for the security sector reform program. There's a putting back in place, uh, sort of a needs assessment to look at what uh, a future security sector reform um, project would entail. And um, I believe that will include uh, a look at the prison sector as well. Uh, so certainly what the needs assessment mission um, who are currently in town will do, uh, I expect to include work on, uh, on the prison service. It was in October of 2015 when James Quinn announced at a press conference that the British government is currently working on an assessment aimed at restarting the security sector reform program here, that the program would restart on the AUS 550 million aid to ace Commonwealth Caribbean states. As to how soon the need assessment will be completed and if he has had talks with the government of Guyana on the recent prison unrest, Mr. Quinn said. I've had recent discussions on prison subsequent to the, the, the deaths and the riots um, a couple of weeks ago. Uh, I expect the sort of action plan and security sector reform and what we do going forward to be completed probably by about the end of April. Um, and then following on from April, we will then be able to see about trying to put in place the various recommendations which I know the mission will come up with. I think the President has very clearly gripped it. I mean, the Minister of Public Security and the Minister of the Presidency um, going, down to, uh, going down to the prison itself. Uh, I, think they're doing a, I think they're doing a very good job in a very difficult circumstance. And certainly I think the level of violence that broke out was unexpected for everyone. So I think the response has been, been good and appropriate. As to how he would grade the David Granger government in handling the prison crisis and if the commission of inquiry is the best possible option to get to the truth of the matter, Mr. Quinn responded. I think if something similar had happened in the UK, you would also have had a commission of inquiry. So I think a commission of inquiry is a, is a, is a very sensible uh, a procedure to try and find out sort of both the root causes of what happened and also what can be done to ensure it doesn't actually happen again in the future. As it relates to local government elections, James Quinn thinks GCOM did as much as they can and it is up to the Guyanese to come out and vote on Friday. He went on to state that he and his observer team will be visiting polling stations across the country. George.